Gaming Mail. Greetings, Gaming Mail fans. Um, another unremarkable, I mean, exciting video for you again. This is part four of Untitled Goose Game. This level's called. Um, Oh, the pub. Sorry, slipped my mind for a second. Um, you can find links below to, found, to find um, parts one, two, three, and five. Anyway, look, just in, in the box, because that's what geese do. That's it. What did you leave an empty box there for? That's it, I'll be a bit of a dance. I was going to say, I couldn't tell if that's a man or a lady, but somebody just gave it away when I saw it from the side. Got a nice red nose. Look, there's what we've got to do. You can pause it if you want to read it yourself. I can't be bothered. Well, I can do, but I'm not reading out loud. You've got to make an old man fall on his ar ar um, bum. And lady said arse. Don't like swearing. Oh, we'll just swore. Sorry, excuse my language. Pardon my French. Except it's not French. I don't think. That's it. Just be curious. Why is it suddenly full when you just put it there empty? Not, don't query it, will you? That goose is an idiot. It's about to get butchered. Anyway, got into the pub. Whoa! You shocker. That's what she's saying. What the blooming heck's that? Is it a dinosaur? No, it's a duck. No, it's not a duck. It's a goose. Same, same difference. Oh, hello. Like your earrings. Oh, thanks. Oh, you don't need to bow. I'm not the queen. Yeah, you go off. Flap me legs. No, they're not legs. Me arms. Be a water the flower. Oh, lovely. Oh, look at that. It's a traditional pub game. That I've never seen in a pub ever. Sorry, mate. I didn't want to ruin your game. Go on, toss it off. Ah, oh, bad luck, player. Oh, he's going to have another go. Why is there a barrel in the middle of the lawn? What sort of pub is this? It's like a lot of pubs run by drunken landlords. I got barred from a pub once by a drunken landlord. Not a really good thing to do, really, if you run a pub. You're just drinking your own prof profits away. Let's make him... Ah, oh, blooming heck. I'm just going to try and make him fall on his... Ah, oh, 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 dear, he's hurt his back. I was trying to make him fall onto his backside. That's it. Play your piano. No, it's not piano. What's it called? Mouth organ. Harmonica. He can't make his mind up when he wants to play oop game. Or play his harmonica. Or just sit down. He hasn't even got a drink. Chuck him out. He's a freeloader. Come on. You don't stop bending down picking that stool up, mate. Your back's hurting that bad. Here we go. Oh. Quite frustrating, I'm sure you'll agree. I'll get it right in a second. Bit of game wheel skill, this is what what's required. Someone keeps going in and out of that gate up there. Distract him again. Get your oop. I'll get your harmonica. I'm going to start playing that in a second. Wouldn't that be ace? If Goose playing the harmonica. You can sell him to a circus. Yes, you got an oop on. Not really much fun though if you're playing with, playing with yourself, is it? Yes! Come on! Down he goes. 
Make the old man fall on his bum. I never use that word. In America, bum is the same as tramp in this country. Whereas tramp in America means a lady who's quite um, friendly with the rewards that she can give a gentleman just by using the body. I think. Right then. What am I going to do now? Just turn that tap on. Oh, she's thinking, where's the goose gone? Why don't she bend down and look under the table? She's that much of an idiot. Also, there's gaps in that table. Why don't you just look through the gaps? Let's get the bolt. Yes, yeah, got the bolt. Yeah, wanga! You're not having it back. Oh, she's lost me again. Gosh darn it, she's saying. But she's not. I bet she's saying, you f f f f f flaming goose. Break the dart ball is one thing I've got to do. Now oh, she's running round. Just tricked her again. Blooming moron. Broke a glass. She's a bit clumsy, she is. Not another glass. The doorman. He wants a, he wants a glass. There's no point, mate. It's empty. What's she doing? Going to get another empty blooming box. Stop staring at me. Everyone keeps staring at me in this blooming game. Bunch of blooming weirdos. Let's go down here. Nope, let's go back up. Maracas here in the toolbox outside that prison door. You have to rewind it, you want to see it again. You don't want to miss out on the excitement, do you? Imagine if you got like a partner and she says one day to you, one day she wants to hear the pitter patter of tiny feet and you came back with a goose. She'd be quite disappointed. She might just be saying that because she just wants a bit of action because it's been a bit quiet in the bedroom. I should imagine. What am I going to do with this? Quiet streets here. Quite a quiet pub actually. Like most pubs these days. Uh, come back down here. No, there's no what's the point you got? Sorry, I'm talking to myself. Oh, of course I'm talking to myself. Might as well be, no one watches these videos. If you're watching it, why don't you if you like them, why don't you look at all my other videos and subscribe and Click the like button thing and the bell as well. The notifications when I put a new video up, which will probably be in about six months. Take me blooming ages these do. I'll just leave that there. Open the gate. Pick that up. Steal a pint glass and drop it in the canal. You get yourself barred, you get caught though. Set the table, break the dartboard. Gotta get back in. Mm -hmm. 
Right, I'm going to try and sneak past him, I think. Oh, no, he's going to bring the box in. Is he? Oh, he's listening to it. That's it. I often do that, just see a box with a lid shut and, and listen to it. Actually, I do that when I buy stuff on Amazon, just to make sure it's not got snakes in. I'm not scared of snakes, but it'd be a bit of a shot, wouldn't it? Come on! Go on, have another listen. Weirdo. So if he's working, he's getting paid for doing nothing. Apart from listening to empty boxes and chasing off goose. As geese as geese. Did you see what I had to do to set the table? That's gonna take blooming ages. Why couldn't that table server woman set the table? Instead of relying on a weird goose. Oh, this woman who keeps carrying a box that was empty a minute ago and then finds it suddenly full of something and keeps carrying it in. Oh, she ain't got special needs in driving that van. Let's break the dartboard. How are they going to break that? Head bust it. No, oh, my neck's not that long. <laughs> not Gideon. Stole his trombone. No one can bend down to look under st look under stuff here. Oh, he's not bothered about it now. No, oh, just sit down. Just think about it. That's it. Look left and right. You're not gonna. Bicycle, you know. You're not looking for traffic or trucks that are about to run you over. Like they do in London. I think that probably happens all over the place. It just uh, only gets reported when it's London, because... Uh, the news tends to be London-centric for some reason. They never feature Stoke-on-Trent that often in the news. Hmm. Come on, best of luck. Yes, break the dartboard. I don't know how that managed to break the dartboard, but... Oh well, it worked. Right, knife, fork, plate, pepper, candle. It looks like a lovely summer's day. Who wants a candle? I don't know which table I've got set. Is that one that was what, the plate already on, or what? Oh, another goose sign. This old, this old town or village is gooseophobic, geeseophobic, geeseophobes. Set that table. There, put that on nice and neat. Fork on the floor. Let's go around here. What purpose does that serve? Apart from helping burglars sneak around at night. What you got there? Another empty box. Is that salt or pepper? <laughs> no, my luck's probably a chess piece. Giant chess piece. Go 
go on. That's it. Oh, precariously balanced. Candle. Fork. Candle. Could make a obvious um, to Ronnie's reference there, but I've said I'm going to say for fork's sake. Nope, that wasn't swearing because fork isn't swearing. Stop chasing me. Whoa! I'm having a seizure. Leave it. There. None of you can see me now. Blowing idiots. Hey, look, there's a knife and fork there. I wonder if they leave them out at night. There we go, got a candle. Where you going with an empty box this time? And pick that other one down there. Oy. Where's he gone? Oh, I don't know, but we've both got fleas. <laughs> no, not really. Head lice. I got a mate who had fleas once. Actually, I, I think it was pubic lice. Crabs. Ah! Put that on there. Cool. Good catch. Gotta put the pepper back on now. I need a knife as well. Oh, I can't see the fl flipping pepper. Come on. You can't change the camera angle. You watch, I'll finish this and find out you can. Oh, it's down there somewhere. Yes! I knew it was. Using my gaming intuition. And not to do with the fact that I remember I just dropped it there about 45 seconds ago. That's just pure coincidence. Keeps doing that. You're not solving any problems, though, are you? By doing some stupid gesture. Go on, scratch your head again. Are you crabs? Knife there. Should blooming more and stop looking at me. Keep staring. Set the table. Job done. Right in. Let's get one of these. Let's get another one of these. What are they? The red oranges. Red apples. Red peppers. Uh, what else could they be? I can't think of anything else that could be red that you can eat. Oh. Tomatoes. Should have thought of that one. No, I was just kidding. I was thinking that first. Honestly. No word of a lie. What am I taking them all out for? It's just a bit of fun. Now <laughs> uh. oh, I said you have a nice stretch, mate. You've been relaxing all day. Under here again. She's wiping the table with them that cloth things. 
I'm sure they're on the floor a minute ago. Don't run away from her. Run away from him. We've received an airline. Yes! Keep looking around. Take it off, you fool. Yeah, I'd already call him a burly man. Look, we're just going to sat in a load of blooming tomatoes. Idiot. Well, that's it for this level, I think. Just leave it out, mate. Um, yeah, that's the end of this level. Uh, level 5 coming up. So, you can watch, like I said, links below to watch 1, 2, 3 and 5. Um, like I said, click subscribe and all that. And uh, overall, I give good, 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 geese, good goose game. Tongue twister. I'm not a pheasant plucker, I'm a pheasant plucker's son. And I'm only plucking pheasant till the pheasant plucker comes. Say rattle your bottles in Rollock's backyard five times fast. No, say it ten times fast, I bet you can't. Anyway, overall, I did this game 9 out of 5 out of 10. Keep your cotton buds dry. Wonga! Where to now? I'll go this way. Let's open the gate for no reason. Here we go. See you later. Bye. Gaming Mail. Well, congratulations, Game Mill fan, for making it this far to the end. Most people don't. Um, Anyway, if you'd like to support me, subscribe, leave your comments below, and click that bell button so you get notified when the uh, my next video's up. Um, also, you can support me on Patreon, because games aren't cheap, and that'll help me a lot. Um, you can find links down in the um, description box below. Uh, you can follow me on um, social media as well, um, Twitter and Facebook, those links are down below as well. Uh, thanks for watching, and keep... Uh, Oh, keep watching. I've got loads of other videos you can watch if you haven't watched them yet. Alright then, I'm going now. Bye.